Matthew chapter 7, verse 13, Jesus said, Enter through the narrow gate, for the gate is wide and the way is broad that leads to destruction, and there are many who enter through it. For the gate is small and the way is narrow that leads to life, and there are few who find it. The only way any human being on this earth will ever be saved is through Jesus Christ. That is all. Because you need to realize the Bible says, For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God, and you have no idea what that means. That we were born radically depraved and God-hating. That we would have never sought God, never come to God. We have rebelled against God, broken every law. It's not just an issue that you have sinned. The issue is you've never done anything but sin. The Bible says in the prophets that even our greatest works are like filthy rags before God. And because of that, you know what we deserve? The wrath of God. God is a holy God. And the only way you and I could ever be reconciled to a holy God is through the death of God's own Son when He hung on that tree. Because when Jesus Christ was hanging on that cross, He bore your sin, the sin of God's people, and all the fierce wrath of God that should fall upon you fell upon His only begotten Son. The only thing that could save a people like us death of God's own Son, under the wrath of His own Father, paying the price, rising again from the dead, powerful to save. This is the gospel of Jesus. Now, what are you called upon to do? You say you go through the narrow gate. How do you do that? Jesus said the time is fulfilled. The kingdom of God is at hand. What must you do? In Mark, He tells us, repent and believe the gospel.